You know, I recall so well during my Christian growth and one of the prayers that we would make and I would hear my pastor praying about is when you know that something that to, to progress you is in the hands of somebody. You will pray that may that person be restless. When you know that somebody you are hoping for something, may they be restless until they do, they advance you. I remember now that even when I would be studying for my results, for my marks, waiting for my results, I would say like, let the lecturer mark according to the way in which it's going, I'm going to pass. May they write, may they even mark everything correctly. Let me tell you, this goes as far as even a marriage proposal. You you tell, especially a man, will tell a woman that is interested. And she'll be like, Sam, young, uh, let me think about it. And we'll be waiting and hoping, let us say yes. Right now, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I want everybody, anyone that is waiting, that is expecting something positive, that open up your heart right now to get and believe with me, that anyone that is responsible for your advancement, whether it's marital life or career-wise, academic-wise, promotion in whatever area, someone that is responsible, whether it is your relative that is arrested, is in jail, incorrect, I don't care, someone that is responsible to advance you, may their heart be opened. May they start thinking about you. May they start being positive. May they not rest until they fulfill. Just like the king who did not sleep in the, for the sake until they got a record of what Mordecai had done and they rewarded Mordecai in the book of Esther. May the king not be restless. May the king be restless. May the person responsible for advancement have no rest until they do it for you. I pray and I decree and I decree over your life right now in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. I'm Ishmael and see you next time.